jokes aside, I'm gonna cry. I want you to see my cool helmet. It's a fashion statement. I went to Tim Hortons and bought the biggest ice cap you can buy, ice cappuccino, because these things are absolutely friggin' delightful. Um, I keep saying, um, stop saying, um. What's up everybody and welcome to today's video. Probably thinking right now, what the heck is she doing? Cause she is not at home and she is outside. I'm gonna tell you in a second. Let me start off by saying, if you are new here, welcome. And if you've been here before, welcome back. My name is Manders, this is my channel. We almost always only talk about makeup, skincare, sometimes some make some food. But today we're gonna talk about skydiving because I am at the Toronto Skydive Center and my husband may or may not be come, falling in out from the sky at any minute. And you guys are gonna get to see something really excited because this video is actually going to show you a little bit of footage of some of the hours leading up to me actually jumping out of an airplane and the actual footage of me jumping out of an airplane. Look, there's a car, somebody's here. So if you're interested in any of those things, make sure you stick around because that is what we're doing for today's video. I'm jumping out of an airplane. I'm not gonna put any makeup on because I have a feeling I'm gonna cry. Jokes aside, I'm gonna cry, which is okay. Apparently a lot of people cry. I am told that it can be a very emotional situation. So far, the emotions that I've gone through over the last few days, even just thinking about it, and then the last 24 hours of actually like deciding that I'm going to do it um, have been a little nerve-wracking so let me know in the comments below if you're around skydiving before and what did you think of it I've heard some people say it's absolutely amazing and then I've heard some people say that they had absolutely horrible experiences so I'm hoping for the first option I don't really want the second option because Pat is actually getting his skydiving license so he's he's getting his license so he won't have to jump out of an airplane with another person, which is what I'm doing. I'm doing a tandem jump with, with a person who has the nickname Bodie, which is my stepson's name, which my stepson was named after Patrick Swayze's character in Point Break. Just saying. In case you didn't know that. It is so friggin' pretty here though. We slept here in the tent last night because the original plan was Pat was gonna jump yesterday and then a couple times today as well because you have to do 10 jumps for this course. But we got here a little bit late. So what we did was we, we unpacked everything. We had supper, I made sandwiches in the car. It was just, it was all around, it was a good day. It worked out really well. So funny story, I did bring makeup and I totally planned on sitting down and filming a tutorial using some really fun makeup products because I'm not gonna put any of them on my actual face. Guess what I forgot? My brushes, like a dumbass. I'm gonna do my brows though. That I'm not gonna skip because I can do that without a brush. I was gonna use my Violet Boss Essentials palette. I could put, use my finger, but I really don't want to for the other reason that I said I'm probably gonna cry. So people, people cry when they're here. Who knew? Who knew that jumping out of airplanes would make people emotional? That mirror is going to blind me. Oh, I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Let's just see, hold on. So this isn't like, this is really hard to do in the sunlight, hold on. I wish I had my laptop with me and I wish I had Wi-Fi because I'd love to, I would have loved to have gone live here. Um, I can't wait. We are on the road to 1,000 subscribers. If you know anybody who might be interested in my kind of content, please feel free to share this. Um, I have been working at my channel for just over a year and I'm very happy with my progress, but the one thing I would love is a community tab just so I can share things, just so I can use my phone whenever, when I'm out to go live if I want. Um, I keep saying, um, stop saying, um. Sorry. But yeah, that's that's a goal of mine. And I will be having a 1,000 subscriber giveaway. So get ready for that. I haven't decided what the prize will be, but I will be filming that video within the next week or so. I went to Tim Hortons and bought the biggest ice cap you can buy, ice cappuccino, because these things are absolutely friggin' delightful. And like a million calories too. So if you're worried about that, you don't want this. Another thing, you know, okay, I'm gonna put on my cool sunglasses. I'm gonna take a seat back and I'm gonna relax as I talk. So, what was I gonna say? 
So I do have to go in and do a course soon. I have to go watch a video. They're gonna do like a little demo and they're gonna kind of get me all suited up and ready to go. So that'll be really interesting. And at the end of this video, of course, you will see the final, the final cut of me jumping. Okay, so I'm still here at the airfield, but Pat is getting on the plane to actually do his jump with his instructor. So I'm gonna flip ya. And there he goes. He's gonna go get ready and he's gonna get into that plane. Holy crap, I've never been in a plane that small. I honestly think that might be the part that's the scariest for me. There they go. All right, guys, I am ready to friggin' rock and roll. I'm going to jump out of an airplane and it's pretty exciting. So wish me luck. By the time you see this, I will have already jumped out of the airplane. But I wanted you to see my cool helmet. It's a fashion statement. I love you guys. See you soon. Uh, we're going skydiving. Skydiving. I'm scared. Scared? Excited? I'm excited scared, Okay. Yes. That's, that's a good mixture. We're gonna jump out of an airplane. Yeah. And we're going to, I'm not going to cry. Okay. That's yeah. Goal. It's going to be awesome. As soon as you leave that door, it's going to be like you're flying. You'll love it. It's wonderful. Awesome. We'll take you up to 12,500 feet, huck you back down to earth and land safely. Okay. You ready, ready for this? Yep. Awesome. <laughs> Thank you. Let's do it. Close till I get up Time is barely on our side I don't want to waste what's left The storms we chase are leading us And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah, No, I don't want to waste what's left And on we'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways Till my shadow Turns the sun rays and on and on we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways, and on and on we'll go. How was that? You just jumped from a plane. Oh, that was good. Yeah. I felt the falling feeling though that everyone's like, you don't feel. <laughs> feel it? <laughs> yeah, it was good though. Awesome. Well, you did great. Thank you for jumping with us. Thank you. Awesome work. Thank you work. for filming it. Thank yeah. You. Thanks very for, welcome. thanks very to Jan welcome. for making this yeah, possible. Yeah, right there. Awesome. I think everybody jumped. All right, we're here. I am in the car waiting for Pat and I went skydiving so it was really fun by now you've already seen the clip 
the the couple clips that I've already had from the skydiving center. Um, let me know in the comments below, have any of you ever tried skydiving? Have you ever thought about trying skydiving? And what did you think of today's video? I know it's a little different, but I really thought this would be a fun way for me to kind of do something different. And it was a really good experience for me. It wasn't as scary as I thought it was going to be, but it was still scary as friggin' hell. For all, it wasn't so bad. I got to jump at the same time as this handsome feller. He jumped right before I did and he got to jump by himself, whereas I didn't. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now. I was going to get an iced coffee. I was like, I'll just get an iced coffee and, or maybe just a regular coffee because I'm tired. We did sleep in the tent last night. I only had one coffee, but then I was like, no, you know what I'm going to get? I'm going to get one. I haven't had one of these in what feels like forever. I probably had one last summer, but I honestly can't remember. Oh my gosh, my hair is doing some super crazy stuff right now. I apologize.